Top bureaucrat Ursula von der Leyen claims a C O R O N a virus vaccine will hit markets before autumn has been discredited by the European Union's own medicines watchdog. After announcing £71.7 million to German pharmaceutical firm CureVac, the German said discussions with its bosses have suggested a inoculation could be ready much sooner than industry predictions. On Monday she said, they are working on a patent that has already been approved and gone through the specific processes that are necessary, so they are highly specialized in this field. And it is their prediction that they might be able towards fall to have a vaccine that is fighting C, O, R, O, N, A, virus. But the European Medicines Agency has poured scorn on the claims, insisting a vaccine could take as many as 18 months before. An EMA spokesman said, we would estimate that it will take six months or more before candidate vaccines are tested in larger clinical studies, and 12 to 18 months before a vaccine against COVID-19 is ready for approval. The watchdog has vowed to push its work into overdrive to ensure coronavirus treatments and vaccines can be given to patients as rapidly as possible. A statement added, ensuring a rapid response to COVID-19 is our number one priority. A special EMA task force has been set up to work on this and the regulatory tools available to accelerate approval. CureVac bosses have stood by their previous pledge to have a vaccine ready by autumn. Dietmar Hopp, the firm's majority shareholder, said, I think our new vaccine against coronavirus should be available by this autumn. That would be in time for the potential next wave of infections. Tests have to be carried out on animals, and then on people. The release date depends on Germany's na According to reports in Germany, CureVac was the subject of attempts by U.S. President Donald Trump to secure exclusive rights for a coronavirus vaccine for his country. Responding, Mr. Hopp said, if we want to develop an effective vaccine, this person must not only reach out and protect people, but also have solidarity with them. The billionaire businessman, who also owns German football club Hoffenheim, rejected the advances and insisted he intends to make the vaccine readily available worldwide. The German finance minister praised CureVac's great decision to rebuke Mr. Trump's advances. Peter Altmaier said, it was a great decision on part of the company's management. With their decision to offer a possible vaccine to everyone, they sent a clear statement to everyone about their feelings towards the crisis.